What's up guys? It's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. Okay, so <laughs> we are finally here in Olivine City, and uh, now it is finally time for us to take care of business going up to the lighthouse because Well, we got stuff to do. We got stuff. Uh, apparently, Jasmine, the Olivine City gym leader, has been missing for quite some time, and that is because she is looking to uh, well, she's taking care of of a Pokemon, a sick Pokemon and all that stuff. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go straight up, well, we're gonna go up to the lighthouse and all that stuff, and we're gonna be battling everybody along the way right here, so here we go. That metronome attack, not really, not really something right here. And here comes a Miracle Eye, don't know what that is, but here comes the extra sensory, and here comes another, wow. We're literally hit, we're literally not using any good moves, and this guy is like, screw it, okay. Let's go right ahead and go straight to Fluffle right here. And let's go with a Charge Boom Attack. Because we need our Pokemon to get up to level 27, 28, you know. Try to evolve it and all that stuff. Okay, so... Let's go right ahead and switch up our Pokemon. Let's go with Fluffle right here. And... Well, let's go right ahead and of course Gina is calling us, so... It is what it is. So let's see what's going on right here. Hmm. Men of the sea are always spoiling for a good fight. Okay. And, well, here we go. Sailor Huey wants the battle. And let's go ahead and speed this up right here. Going with a, well, a charge beam attack and bam. Here comes a Poliwhirl. And yes, we're trying our hardest to get this Pokemon to level 30. And, well, bam, level 27 right here. And, of course, we're going to get the phone numbers to everybody. So, let's go right ahead. Let's go right ahead and just uh, continue on right here. Now I'm thinking that maybe if I just battle my, uh, if I battle my Fluffolt in, in this one, yeah, we, we might get it to level 30. Who knows? So here it is, guys, taking on another trainer, and this guy is a bird trainer. He does have four of these Pokemon, so let's go right ahead and shock them all. There we go. Special attack has risen, and there we go again. See, look at that. Okay, so. It's looking like a good possibility. Look at that. Okay, so here we go again. Charge bar. Okay, charge beam. And let's go one more time. And just like that, we win. Okay, so let's go right ahead. Now, before we go outside, let's go ahead and take on this trainer right here. Let's see what she has to say. Jasmine is the, is the city's gym leader. I intend to bring her back with me. Nobody better get in my way. Well, it looks like everybody just loves every like everybody loves everybody here. Okay, so here we have Connie coming in with her Meryl. So this is probably a perfect place to train your well, if you guys have a Flappy and all that stuff, then well, <laughs> this is the place to go. So let's go right ahead and grab this. We get ourselves the TM87, and that is Swagger. And well, first things first. I yeah, I need a yeah, first things first, I need to actually use an ether right here because I kind of feel as though we're going to be needing that uh, charge beam now. Yes, I know, I know. I, I need more attacks, but, you know, once we evolve our uh, our Fluffolt, then bam, yeah, we're going to be, uh, yeah, once we evolve our Flappy or our Fluffolt, yes, we're going to be okay. So here we go, taking on another trainer, Gentleman Preston, and he is going to be uh, going with a Growlithe right here. So here we go, bam. We're just gonna, yeah, we're just gonna go with Fluffle right here because, yes, look at that, level 28. We are good. We are very, very good right here. Okay, so we got two more levels. Now, if you go right here, you're gonna be falling straight in front of the, well, you're gonna be in uh, in the outside of the lighthouse. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Very, very cool. Anywho, there is an item right here waiting for you, and this is exactly what we're gonna be needing. And that is a rare candy. That is always awesome. So I'm going to save that until Fluffbolt gets to level 29. That way, you know, that, that that way we can actually, you know, easily evolve it and all that stuff. So here we go. Let's get it. Jasmine must be worried sick about Pokemon here. She won't even smile these days. Oh. So tell me that she's a very smiley person. Okay. So here we go. Checking on Sailor Kent. And he's coming out with his Krabbies and all that stuff. So there we go. Come on. Bring him out. That's right. Feed my Fluffbolt. That's right. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab this item and look at that. We found ourselves another ether, which is always nice. And, well, let's see. We got another trainer waiting for us right here. I wonder who this guy is. 
And we're pretty high up here. My bird Pokemon are in prime form. You don't say. Okay, so here we go. Taking on Bird Keeper Dennis. And, well, let's go ahead and speed this up. And that right there increases uh, my power just a little bit. So let's go one more time. And bam. And we... Oh, my God. We are so close. Fluffle, come on. Here we go. Charge beam for the win. Say hello to level 29. Okay. So it looks like we are actually going to evolve Fluffolt. Yes. Okay, so let's go ahead and use that rare candy. Put it to good use and all that stuff. So let's go right ahead. Not this one. The PP up. Let's go ahead and go with the rare candy. And give that to Fluffolt and say hello to level 30. Okay. So here it is, guys. Flaffy or Fluffolt is a finally... It's finally getting up there, and it's finally evolving. And would you look at that. Bam. It's final stage. Ampharos. Okay. Alrighty. And after evolving, after evolving a Flaffy into Ampharos, it is starting to learn Thunder Punch. This right here is a physical move, but it does. it is very, very uh, powerful. As you guys can see, we're more of a special attacker than anything, but we are, yeah, we're in definite need of another move. So let's go right ahead and take out, take out Thunder Wave since we already have the static ability. And there you go. Bam. Finally, another move. Okay, so there you go, Fluff Volt. Finally evolved. And uh, let's go ahead and take a look at this Pokemon right here. There is one thing that I forgot. I, <laughs> I just realized this, but here is Fluff Volt, the Ampharos, and its stats has gone up very, very good with the special attacks, of course. As you guys can see, yeah, not a very good speedy Pokemon, but we can take care of that. And, uh, well, let's go right ahead. Actually, first, first is first. Let's go right ahead and take a look at it, Fluff Volt. It's confused, and it's like, huh, it's holding something. Would you like to take it? Yes, I do. And what would this be? It is a Mystic Fire. Oh, wow. And that's from the, the, the case. Okay, so let's see. Looking at... Okay, never mind. Okay, so that is uh, pretty awesome right there. Let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go straight to Nessie. And let's go ahead and take care of business right here. Speaking of being sick, I've heard that there's a good pharmacy up in uh, Cyanwood City. Okay, so Cyanwood City is the way to go. And... Well, let's get it up here. Let's go right here and we got a few trainers left holy crud okay so here it is bring it on sailor sailors are both kind and strong how about you i don't know i think we're both strong okay so let's go with the body slam and yeah we're getting yeah we're getting slapped all over but guess what it is all right okay so let's move on right here take to this guy and well let's see what he has to say i wanted to battle jasmine but she's not up to it now so how about it Okay, so here we go, taking on Sailor Roboito, and well, let's go right ahead and just beat these guys. Now, yeah, Nessie is weak against fighting type Pokemon, but it is a very, very strong Pokemon right here, so let's go right ahead and go straight for, well, we're, we're asleep, we're getting slapped, we're getting wet, come on, wake up, man, the slap should be waking you up, and there you go, Roboito has been defeated. Okay, now, there is this individual right here, and if you talk to him, if I can, let's see, there it is, hello, hello, just when you least expect it, I am the camera and the photographer, you look photogenic, why not have a t your picture taken? Alright then, get yourselves ready, and, well, luckily for us, we evolved uh, our good old buddy Fluffolt, so now we got a very, pretty good picture, look at that, a pretty stacked team, I should say, and, well... It's a pretty good picture. Now, I don't really take a lot of pictures, but this one you can actually find in your PC. My thing is, I really wish that I could have uh, done a progression picture of the Pokemon that I was at with. And here we're finding the Super uh, Repel. And, well, let's go right here. And would you look at that? Oh, crap. Ha! Actually, let's go right ahead and switch it out to uh, Fluffle right here. And... Well, let's see. Fluffolt, how's it going? This Pokemon has always kept the sea lit at night, but it suddenly got sick. It's Gaspy for hair. 
I understand that there is a wonderful pharmacy in Sinewood, but that's across the sea and I can't leave Amphi unattended. And well, she's punching in a code and all that stuff and well, we got easy access now. And she's gonna be like, may I ask you to get some medicine for me, please? Sure, why not? Anything for you. And well, yeah, this Amphros is uh, not feeling so good right now. And I, Wait, 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 hold on just a sec. I wanna see something right here. I wanna see something right here, okay? Uh, Buffalo is looking. Okay, what about? Okay, what about now when when you're looking at one of your, one of your own? Okay, there we go. There it is! Exclamation point! Your Pokemon seems to be happy to found something. Huh? Did it find somebody or something? Okay, so we grab this item. We're finding ourselves a super potion, and that right there is that. Now we have easy access to this. Uh, we have easy access to the elevator, and it will get us to, down to the bottom floor right here. And, well, would you look at that? Okay, so we have arrived. Okay, so there is a little something that I just realized. Something that I didn't do a few episodes ago, and I'm pretty sure many of you guys are like, Draven, seriously, you forgot. So, I'm going to get down to it. I'll be right back with you to get that special item that we need. Okay, so here we are in Mr. Pokemon's house, and I uh, completely forgot about this, guys. So... A few episodes ago, we have, uh, what was it called? Uh, we have captured the good old buddy, the Red Gyarados, and of course, our mothers has to call us right here because we have quite a few items. Look at that, okay. No one cares, Mom, sorry. Anywho, yeah, we got the Red Gyarados, and on top of it all, we got ourselves a Red Scale, and we completely forgot about this. So after this guy, he's gonna be like, hmm, the Red Scale? What's, what, what, what's that, a Red Gyarados? That's rare, I, I, I want it. Draven, would you care to trade it? I can offer this experience share I got from Professor Oak, and sure, we're gonna be getting the experience share because we need that. We definitely need it. Okay, so that was pretty much it right there, guys. So in the next episode, we're gonna be going across the street, the sea, and then we're gonna be battling every person on the sea. And uh, yeah, we got quite a few things to accomplish, like, you know, go to Sinewood City, the Safari Zone, all that fun stuff. So thank you guys again for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode as we go to Sinewood City. See you guys.